When scientists discovered this deep sea creature, they realized it had an impressive power. Some of our planet's weirdest creatures live in incredible environments on the deep ocean floor. Take this sea creature, for example. It inhibits hydrothermal vents, often one mile and more below the water's surface. Hydrothermal vents are a relatively new discovery that first came to light in 1977 in waters near the Galapagos Islands. On the face of it, these environments are deeply hostile to life. And yet, to their astonishment, scientists have discovered a wealth of life forms living around the vents, many of them previously unrecorded by science. In order to survive, the mass majority of life on Earth depends on sunlight and the energy that it provides. But life forms that cluster around hydrothermal vents actually get their energy and sustenance from bacteria. One such hydrothermal vent was discovered in the depths of the Indian Ocean in 2000. It's a type of vent known as a black smoker, and in 2001, an expedition by the scientific exploration vessel RV Noor was sent to the site to explore its life forms in detail. The vent was named Karai, after the ship that first found it in 2000. When scientists aboard the Noor arrived at the site a year later, they found a wide variety of life in the waters around the Karai Field's black smokers. The scientists also observed gastropods. These creatures come from the same family as both marine and land-based snails and slugs. But there was one particular sea snail that caught their attention above all else because of its pretty unique features. The animal's scientific name, however, is Chrysomalan squizziferum and it was unlike anything the scientists had ever seen before. The scaly foot gastropod lives in the Karari field, which has an astonishing depth of up to more than 8,000 feet, or about 1.5 miles. Their shells are on average over an inch wide, with the largest among them stretching almost two inches. This weird-looking creature also has a broad snout and a mouthpiece made up of a set of muscles arranged in a circle. The scaly foot gastropod is a hermaphrodite, which means that it doesn't need to mate to produce fertile eggs. And the animal is distinctive for its huge heart, too, which makes up some 4% of its body volume. Not least of the scaly foot gastropod's unique features is its foot. The gastropod uses this flattened surface to propel itself around underwater. Look at any snail and you'll see this characteristic foot but the scaly foot is different. These strange metallic additions give the gastropod's foot extra protection, but that extra protection goes much further than that. These extraordinary beasts have shells that are composed of iron. This iron-covered shell really makes the scaly foot unique. There is no other animal known to science that has a skeleton with an iron content. And, in fact, the scaly foot's shell actually has three layers. The outer layer is the iron one, but there's also a spongy middle layer. Indeed, this amazing armored shell may very well be of interest to those engineers who are developing body armor for humans. Scientists at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, or MIT, have conducted experiments on the gastropod's unique structure. In its incredible underwater home, the gastropod uses its armor plating to protect itself from predators, especially crabs, and its unique qualities may help to improve various products as well as body armor. After the discovery of the scaly foot gastropod at the Karai hydrothermal vents, more were discovered at two other sites on the bed of the Indian Ocean. Scaly foots were found at the Solitaire Field in 2009 by the deep sea submersible DSV Shinkai 6500 and the Long Kwai site in 2011 by the British Royal Research Ship James Cook. These discoveries showed that the scaly foots have a wide geographical distribution. Solitaire is some 430 miles from Karai, while Long Kwai is about 1,000 miles from Solitaire. 
As if this ironclad snail wasn't weird enough, the variety and downright eccentricity of some of the other species found at the Karai Black Smoke Chimney and other hydrothermal vents in the world's oceans is astonishing. One particularly bizarre example was found in the Pescadero Basin in the California Gulf. At 12,500 feet deep, this gulf is home to the deepest Pacific Ocean vents known to science. In 2015, the exploration vehicle Nautilus was on a trip to hydrothermal vents near the Galapagos Islands when it came across a specimen of the utterly peculiar flamboyant squidworm. First discovered in 2007, Tuthydradrillus semi is a kind of annelid worm. Scientists are still exploring the hydrothermal vents found in the deep ocean and still finding peculiar animals previously unknown to science. The scaly foot gastropod with its unique iron shell is just one of these eccentric beasts of the depths.